your weekend forecast. Hot and humid out here, Carly. Yes, that's definitely what we're talking about. Starting today, even through the extended forecast, we have those temperatures low 90s. Feeling with that heat index, mid to upper 90s, even some that triple digit heat. So definitely take care of yourself for this weekend out in the heat. Do not leave kids, pets in the car. Do that isolated, really late day storm chance. Not a washout for this weekend, just a few of those passing storms. And we do have Tropical Storm Fay that is not impacting us. It has moved off of our coast, off towards the north, and really will continue on that northward movement. You can see a lot more of the rain upwards they'll get upwards about three to five inches as that does continue along the mid-atlantic coastline and then back behind you can see kind of that trailing line as far as those storms the clouds but that is out off towards the east and out over the ocean so no impacts for this morning have some cloud cover hanging around but otherwise that's about it this morning it is warm and it is muggy Mid-70s for a good portion, even 78 already in Burlington. 68 in Galax, and we will just continue with that sunshine to heat things up. 92 today for the Triad, 90 degrees in the foothills, and mid-80s for the mountains. Again, we will feel a little bit hotter from time to time, so stay hydrated. Take breaks outside in the heat. There's that storm chance, about 30 to 50% for the afternoon. And really for the evening, that's where I think the Triad could see the best of that activity pass on through. Lunchtime, just those clouds and sunshine. Isolated storm trying to get going. Afternoon, mainly mountains, foothills. Can see a little bit for the triad, but here's by about dinner time. Kind of those cluster of storms trying to pass on through then into the evening for the triad. Not looking like severe activity. It's a lot like how we have been this week. Some get the heavy downpours. Some stay dry. Still can find some lightning, gusty winds, so keep an eye to the skies if you do have those outdoor plans, and especially on the water. Saturday morning, we are starting really about the same way as this morning. Then we uh, heat things up by lunchtime, afternoon, evening, right back to low 90s, and just that isolated storm chance, as you saw, doesn't amount to a whole lot. So I think most of us, even just about all of us, really staying dry for tomorrow. Sunday, we do have a chance for a bit more of those isolated storms to pass through. Monday, back to the scattered side as we start off your next week. And all the way throughout your upcoming week, keeping that 90-degree heat sticking around.